So for this tutorial, we will cover the bare minimum that you need to know before using Moveit. The first thing is that Moveit handles input differently, where traditional character user add movement input node, Moveit instead uses add forward movement input and add right movement input. If your game uses a Z axis, maybe for swimming or flying, then you can still use this node instead. But for moving forward and moving right, for the animation to work properly, you will want to use these nodes. Now the other thing is that your character needs to be a very specific distance from the ground for the foot IK to be accurate. And if you go to the construction script in BP Move It character, you'll find something that isn't hooked up. And if we hook it up and hit compile, you'll notice we get this number output here. Get rid of the trailing numbers, but this is exactly what our mesh Z offset should be. And this gives us a correctly positioned mesh relative to the capsule. So if you change the capsule size, or you change the mesh, you should run this construction script so that it will give you the correct Z offset. And this will make sure that it is the correct height from the ground. You can read the wiki for more information on why this formula is required and why it works.